develop a machine learning model of high quality, people typically suffer through a trial and error process for algorithm selection and hyperparameter tuning. Automated machine learning is proposed as an AI solution to the ever-growing challenge of applying machine learning. However, AutoML methods usually work as black boxes, which raises a trust issue. ATM SEER is an interactive visualization system, which is designed to address these trust issues by improving the transparency and controllability of AutoML processes. The interface of ATM SEER consists of three components. The control panel allows users to upload a dataset and create an AutoML process. The overview panel shows high-level statistics of the dataset and the AutoML process. The three-level AutoML profiler helps users analyze an AutoML process at different granularities, from the algorithm level, to the hyperpartition level, to the hyperparameter level. In the algorithm level, the performance of all the models of an algorithm is summarized as a horizontal histogram. In the hyperpartition level, one box is a hyperpartition and the bars inside the box stand for models. The height of a bar indicates the performance of the model. In the hyperparameter level, each model is represented as a circle in the scatter plot, where the x-axis represents the value of one hyperparameter and the y-axis represents the performance. When users create a new AutoML process, they can monitor and control the process in real time. Users can also perform a run configure run workflow by using an in situ configuration that is embedded in the three level profiler. Here we demonstrate two case studies of ATM SEER. Based on the best performance score and algorithm coverage, the expert was satisfied with the results and decided to stop the AutoML process. Since the top 10 models had similar performance scores, the expert decided to further compare them on the algorithm level. Compared with other algorithms, the histogram of KNN had no bars close to the bottom, indicating that all KNN models have a relatively high performance score. To improve confidence in using a KNN model, the expert wanted to learn why some of the models have less satisfying performance. The expert opened the hyperpartition level view of KNN. They found that the best performance scores of each hyperpartition are similar. Meanwhile, the height of the bars in the same box seems very different, indicating that one hyperpartition could have both good and bad models. The expert then opened the hyperparameter level view and found that most poorly performing KNN models have a small number of neighbors. The expert had strong domain knowledge and wanted to have more control over an AutoML process. He first analyzed which algorithm was better for the given dataset. After the algorithm coverage reached 100%, the expert observed the algorithm level view. He decided to focus on Extra Trees, an algorithm that he was familiar with and that performed well on the given dataset. After more Extra Trees models are tested, the expert analyzed the hyperpartition level view. He found that the best performance scores of the two Extra Trees hyperpartitions were close. The height of the bars in these two boxes had similar distributions, indicating similar performance distributions. As a result, the expert kept trying both extra trees hyperpartitions. On the hyperparameter level view, the expert found that a larger value of max features led to better performance. This observation was inconsistent with the expert's prior knowledge about the best empirical values of max features. The expert modified the search space accordingly and continued the process. He stopped the AutoML process when the best so far performance line chart didn't change for 20 trials and then chose the top extra trees model. ATM SEER has other potential usage scenarios that we'd like to explore in the future. First, it can help beginners learn machine learning models. 
Users can observe how the choice of algorithms, hyperpartitions, and hyperparameters influences model performance. For example, MLP can easily get poorly performing models compared to random forest. SVM with different kernel functions can have different best performance scores and different performance distributions. Second, it can help AutoML developers identify possible bugs in AutoML algorithms. For example, MLP is tried more times than Random Forest, even though their best performance scores are similar and all Random Forest models have good performance. Such a pattern makes the AutoML developers wonder why there is a bias in favor of MLP.